so make sure to follow my methods for the first method go to the windows taskbar open this upside arrow after that look for the antivirus that you have for example i have avast right click on it and then select manage shields and select disable for 10 minutes after that go to open quarantine once done it will redirect you to the section that the antivirus may be put some files related to ubisoft or rainbow six siege as a threat so you need to check that by looking to the path right here if you do find any related path to steam ubisoft rainbow six siege you should just select it right here after that go to these three dots and select restore and add exception for the next method you should go to the search and type in windows security once done open it now click on protection against threats and viruses after that scroll down select manage settings scroll all the way down after that you can see the exclusion section select add or delete an exclusion from here you need to select add an exclusion after that select folder now all you have to do go to your c drive after that look for program files 86 type it after that look for the steam folder select it and click on select folder do the same thing for the ubisoft folder it will be appearing like this so that's it close that after that for the next method go to the search and type in view network connections it will redirect you like this so look for your wi-fi double click on it after that select properties now look for tcp ipv4 double click on it then switch the second one to use the following dns type in like this 8888 and the second one 8844 after that select ok and make sure to close everything for the second method go to the search and type in cmd and make sure to run it as an administrator now you need to type in this command ipconfig space slash release hit enter after that type in like this ipconfig space slash renew and hit enter and then type in ipconfig space slash flash dns and hit enter and lastly you should type in net space winsock space reset and hit enter for the last time now you can close the cmd now for the second method you can go ahead and open the steam launcher after that go to the left corner and select the view option and select the library option from here after that look for rainbow six siege it must be installed i have it right here you can select the game after that click on this gear icon and select properties now go to installed files and select verify integrity of game files just wait for this process to finish it will recover any missing or corrupted file after that you can close everything you can try relaunching the game and see if it works otherwise you can go ahead to the windows icon and restart your computer and try again make sure to like and subscribe and see you on the next one